Hello everybody, praise be to God, and welcome back to the Secret of Monkey Island Special Edition. We're now sailing on the high seas on our way to Monkey Island, and unfortunately our crew is kind of mutinied against us. Whoops! Anyhow, we gotta find our way to actually navigate to Monkey Island, because we don't know the way. It looks like an empty chest. Oh, really? I can't pick that up. Well, that's unfortunate. It looks like that captain's drawer. Okay, let's open it. There's an old dusty book inside. Sweet. Let's see what it is. Oh, well, let's take a look-see, shall we? It says, Captain's Log, March 10th. First mate Toothrot and I have been searching for Monkey Island for over a month with no success. The directions we purchased on Melee proved to be a recipe, not a map as we had believed. Captain's Log, March 12th. I wish Toothrot would take a bath. Captain's Log, March 17th. I wish Toothrot would stop snoring. Captain's Log, March 23rd. Toothrot is really starting to get on my nerves. I figure it's only a matter of time before we come to blows. Captain's Log, April 2nd. As a gesture to restore our friendship, Toothrot offered to fix dinner tonight. Captain's Log, April 3rd. I don't know how we did it, but we've arrived at Monkey Island. Both Toothrot and I passed out from the soupy fix last night. When we awoke, Monkey Island was sitting off the bow. Captain's Log, April 4th. Toothrot and I filled the rowboat with supplies and are ready to set out to Monkey Island. We are both excited at the prospect of being the first civilized people to learn the secret of Monkey Island. Captain's Log, April 5th. We had to turn around and return to the ship. Toothrot forgot to go to the bathroom before we left. Oh, of course. We'll set out again tomorrow. There's always one person. And that's the last entry. Well, it's good for us to know. Ooh, a feather pen. It looks like a ballpoint feather pen. Well, you never know when you might need that. Let's see. Ooh, that's a swanky bed with the skulls in <laughs> engraved on it. It's made. Yeah, it is. Dealer prep. It seems to be locked up tight. Nothing in the cabinet. Aw, man. Ooh, there's ink. I don't see anything special about it. Can we pick it up? Yeah, we can. Excellent. It looks like a ballpoint feather pen. I don't see anything special about it. Oh, well, you're not looking hard enough. It's the top of a cereal box, used as a bookmark. Oh, interesting. Well, that's just about everything in there, I think. Um, would you mind putting on some pants? Come on, dude, seriously. <laughs> what a bunch of lazy pigs. <laughs> oh. What was that? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, what's happening? Beat it, guy brush. Oh, come on! What what the heck, Otis? I let you out! I hear the weather's pretty nice over by Monkey Island. <laughs> nice try, Guybrush, but no banana. Are you serious? I'm gonna give you mutineers five seconds to come to your senses. Then, I'm gonna start kicking some butt. Excuse me, Guybrush. Does the word keelhole mean anything to you? Wow. I see your point. <laughs> oh, come on! Why couldn't I actually say that? Is there anything I can do to get you guys to help me? Uh, excuse me, Guybrush. You're blocking the sun. Are you serious, guys? I think I'll be getting back to tending the ship. Where'd you get the wine? Are you serious? Oh, there's a hatch. There's a hidden hatch down here. I'm going down. Oh, this is where the crew sleeps. I get the cool bed, though, because I'm the captain. Uh, is there anything to examine here? There really isn't. Let's go down this way. Woo, it's the kitchen! Yes! Whoa, um, hi there. Uh, 
<laughs> wow, Captain Crunch, you have seen better days. Mmm. I loved this stuff when I was a kid. I like the way it chewed up the roof of your mouth. Oh, well, we gotta have some of that. Can we pick up more than one? I can't pick one? that up. Oh. Oh well, well now we got a, um... A box of cereal. It's about the same size as my head. Oh, hey! We had a pot just like that before the Fettuccine Brothers took it as their helmet. It's good to have another one. Looks like you're one of the mill ship's cooking pot. Alright. Well, if we need to cook anything, we know where to go now. Let's head down here. Ah, the brig! Or the hole, or whatever it is. I don't know my ship lingo very well. There's some very fine wine in here. Oh! I'll grab it! Heck yeah, you're gonna grab that. Let's look at the fine wine. Now, I'm no enologist, but judging from the deep red color, this is a very fine wine. Wait, deep red color? It's not red. It's like a blue bottle with nondescript liquid inside. Ooh, chests. They're just old rusty chests. Can't I open them? They're all rusted shut. I guess not. Oh, oh, gunpowder. Gunpowder. Heck yeah. They look like kegs of gunpowder. Wow, gunpowder! Yeah. I'll take some. Heck yeah. Gunpowder is going to be cool. Looks explosive. <laughs> no, really? The black chest. Ooh, are we going to get cursed if we open it? Can Guybrush turn into an airplane? It's just an old rusty chest. Oh, man. Oh, man, I wanted to do that. They're just old empty kegs. All right, I guess that's everything in the brig. Or whatever it is. Is there really nothing else here? Oh, rope ladder up to the crow's nest. What a fine-looking flag. I need that. Shivers me timbers just looking at it. <laughs> I need that for my room. Ooh, it's a cannon. I don't see anything special about it. Really, Guybrush? Come on, it's a freaking cannon. That's pretty cool, right? No, not the rope ladder. Not the rope ladder. Let's walk up here, if possible. Unless it's like, well, nothing here. Maybe there's nothing here. If we close the door, is there something behind it? Maybe not. It's empty. It I is. can't pick that up. Aww. Hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, we got it's some pamphlets called here. How to get a leg up in treasure hunting. Okay, can we read it? How about the leaflet? It's called How to Get Ahead in Navigating. How about this? It's called How to Arm Yourself in Sea Battle. Why is it so thin? That doesn't seem to work. It's the top of a cereal box, used as a bookmark. Can we open the cereal? <laughs> crunch, 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 crunch. Great! <laughs> a toy prize inside! Yay! Let's look at the prize. I said, let's look at the this prize. This is no prize. It's a small key with a finely engraved monkey on it. Oh! What's that doing in a cereal box? Maybe we can use it to open the cabinet. Heck yeah! Treasure! It looks like a very heavy metal chest. I, we found the treasure of uh, Monkey Island, guys! We're ending the game early, I guess. Man, that's heavy. Filled, no doubt, with golden jewels. Hey, look, a piece of paper! Aw, oh, man! And some cinnamon sticks. Ooh, I like cinnamon sticks. Those are good. Yeah. I don't see anything special about it. But there's cinnamon sticks. Piece of paper. Directions to Monkey Island.
preheat pot to 450 degrees. Add the following ingredients. One cinnamon stick, four leaves of mint, one human skull, pressed, one squirt squid ink, two pints monkey blood, mmm, one live chicken, three ounces brimstone, one or more of the following. Pyridoxine hydrochloride, zinc oxide, yellow eight, mine mononitrate, and BHA. Let bubble over a low flame until thickened. Serves crew of four. Okay then. Not directions, but hey, maybe it'll make a sweet stew. Let's try it. Yeah, Alright, guys, I hope you don't mind. I'm gonna go uh, cook up some dinner now. You guys are gonna love it. No, no, I wanna pick up the I can't pick cereal. That up. All right, I guess I can't do that. All right. Well, we need a cinnamon stick. I love cinnamon. Yeah, so do I. Uh, one pressed human skull. We got the Jolly Roger. Let's see. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we need the squid ink. Just a drop. Ooh, fine wine. That should be enough. <laughs> For the monkey blood. Um, dick. Go up, please. Thank you. Uh, feather pen? Should we use that? Yeah, why not? Yeah, come on. Ooh. Use the breath mints. Good thing I've got a million of these. <laughs> Goodbye, rubber chicken. We need a chicken in the recipe. About time I got rid of this wordless artifact. It's helped us out a lot, though, let's be honest. I'm not putting in the t-shirts. Put gunpowder in as well. Ah, uh, what else? Ooh, let's use the cereal as well. This is gonna be good. Yikes! <laughs> oh, I think I'm getting dizzy. Overcome by the fumes and stench, Guybrush quickly loses consciousness. Moments later, the voodoo spell kicks in, turning the ship to an unknown heading, and off on its mysterious voyage. What's gonna Days happen now? pass. Wait, really? Guybrush was passed out for days? He'd have serious brain damage at this point. Oh, I feel awful. Well, that's what you get for eating Captain Crunch cereal. Captain Crunch is good for one bite, and then after that, it's terrible. In my personal opinion. Then again, I also don't eat cereal with milk, so that might be part of the problem. Holy monkey bladders! It's Monkey Island! Yep. That actually was the directions to Monkey Island. Making that was a spe apparently a voodoo spell that uh, conjured our ship to teleport to Monkey Island. Let's walk to Monkey Island! It's too far to walk to, and besides, I can't swim. Come on, Guybrush, if you could swim and hold your breath for ten minutes, that would be amazing. Wow, this was well worth fifty nine ninety five plus tax. <laughs> <laughs> nice reference to the price of the game. I actually don't think it was that expensive back in the day. I hope not. <laughs> hey, look! We've made it to Monkey Island! Let us know when you found the governor. We've got an extra chair she can use. <laughs> wow, okay then. Well, we could blast ourselves to the islands, potentially. Why don't say anything special about it? What do we have in our inventory? All right. Anything else in here? Nope, nothing else in there. All right, well, we're going to need more gunpowder, methinks. Actually, can I get a couple of things of gunpowder? I'll take some more. I've got enough gunpowder for now. Never mind. Just one. Oh, we also need a way to light it, probably. Um, let's see. Oh, I know. We can finally get rid of the minutes. That doesn't seem to work. Or maybe we can't. Um, I don't want to give up my cotton t-shirts. Oh, can I use that in the red hot fire? Or would that be a stupid idea? 
Yeah, like I really want to kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Guybrush is smarter than me. Let's see. Can we? We don't really want to look at the burn the book. Can we burn the business card? I'll just burn them all. Yeah! Take that, Stan. So now we've got a lit fire in our pockets. What could go wrong? Let's use gunpowder in the cannon. And there's no place back here to put the gunpowder. Can we open the cannon? It doesn't seem to open. Ah, cannon nozzle. Cannon nozzle. Deja vu. <laughs> Yeah, no wonder. Deja vu. Deja vu. Deja vu. Deja vu. Can we get in? Oh, we gotta use the pot. I'm gonna put this on if I really have to. All right. Can we use the flaming mass on the cannon? I wouldn't want to set that on fire. Can Deja we, vu. Can we not get inside the cannon? Come on, guy brush. I don't see anything special about it. It doesn't seem to open. Can that doesn't seem to work. I can't pick that up. No, can we push it? I can't move it. How? I want you to climb inside, Guybrush. Come on. Yikes! <laughs> yes, yikes indeed. Yikes! No, I want to use that. I wouldn't want to set that on fire. Can we grab that rope, I wonder? Because I know we have to shoot ourselves out of the cannon, but I don't exactly remember how. Can we walk to Monkey Island now? Come on, Gabrush, I need you to get in the cannon. It's too far to walk to, and besides, I can't swim. Eh. Ooh, that's refreshing. Alright, well, there's a rope here somewhere that we can definitely get, which I think we're going to need and, uh, to launch ourselves out of the cannon. Come on, Guybrush, maybe there's something on the crow's nest we didn't get. Or maybe the crow's nest literally just exists so you can get the Jolly Roger. Sure, why not? Is there really nothing in this place? Aha! There's the rope. I figured this is a ship. There can't be... There's gotta be a few ropes around here. Also, this ship is really nice. I don't know what Stan was saying why this is like a piece of junk. This is amazing. It's a giant piece of rope. Let's use the rope on the cannon. There we go. Use the flaming mass with the fuse. Now walk to the cannon nozzle. Hurry, guy brush. <laughs> and part three, under Monkey Island. So part two is very short. We got through it in one episode. Nice. And now we actually are on Monkey Island. Hey, monkey. You're very disproportionate for a monkey. Um, thank you. Hi! I'm Herman Toothrot! <laughs> oh, of course. Don't bother to say hello. I've only been waiting 20 years to talk to somebody civilized. I don't mind. Can't you By the way, you might want to think about putting out that fire. Someone could be hurt. Thanks for nothing, too fraught. Ooh, it's a piece of paper. Notice of public meeting. There will be a meeting Wednesday evening to discuss the recent occupation of the sacred monkey head by the ghost pirate LeChuck. 
and the subsequent impact on the environment and the tourist trade. <laughs> All Monkey Island cannibals are encouraged to attend. All right. Well, hey, it's good to know there are civilized cannibals here. All right, we're finally on Monkey Island. It's only took us like nine episodes to get here. I think that's a great spot to end the episode. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Color Farty. If you tune in next time, we'll be able to explore Monkey Island in a lot more detail. Hope to see you then. Until we meet again, have a great day and God bless.